Hey guys, welcome to this playthrough of Spirit Island. Today we're playing with Stone's Unyielding Defiance and we're going up against Brandenburg, Prussia, level 3. Um, I've set up the board, we're using board C. Uh, the initial explorer was into the jungles um, and I think that is all for... We're using events as well, so that's all for setup. Um, so I think we can move on to the, the first turn. For the first action, I'm going to take growth option two, gain three energy, two, three, and place my presence up to two away from where I have presence, so I'll place it in the jungle. And I then I gain the three energy from the energy track. And I'm going to play Jagged Shards Push from Earth, which is a slow power. Um, and that's all I can do for this round. Um, we flip the top event card but don't resolve it. There's no fear cards. We're building in the jungle. So this gets a town. And this gets a town. And we're exploring into the mountains. So we have mountain and mountain. Invader cards advance. And now we move on to the slow phase. So with Jagged Charge push from Earth. Uh, I'm going to add a Badlands in range 1. I'm going to add it there and push this Dahan into the jungle. Um, and that is all the slow powers for this turn. And we move on to the next turn. And for this turn, I'm going to take Growth Option 2 again. And I'm going to place Presence in the Mountain in 3. Um, and then I'm going to gain the Minor Power. This is part of his special rules. So we have rights of land rejection, um, which has the earth element, which is very valuable for stone. Thriving choke fungus, what a name. <laughs> uh, inflame the fires of life and reaching grasp. I think given uh, the importance of stone's innates, I'm going to take rights of lands rejection uh, as the minor power and we also have plus one card play per turn now i'm going to gain the three energy from the energy track and i'm going to play stubborn solidity and plows shatter on rocky ground which costs a total of three so one two three uh, i'm going to target land number one uh, with a defend for defend defend one per Dahan, so we have a defend two, um, and Dahan in target land cannot be changed. That is all I want want to do for the fast power cards. Um, we do have two Earth, so whenever Blight is added to one of our lands, which it will be here, uh, I will pay two energy to take it from the box instead of the Blight card. Um, so we'll, we'll see that in the ravage phase. Events, uh, healthy island. On each board, choose a land with cities, build there. Um, so there is only one land. Uh, I will remove the disease, um, which prevents the build. Beasts, uh, beasts chase off homesteaders. Push up to two explorers or one town from a land with beast. Um I think I will, there is only one land with beast and I think I will leave it where it is. Um, although if I push this in here, um, then there will be no blight and I'll save energy. So I think I'll do that. Um, and then rally to the defense of distant kin on each board, gather one Dahan into a land with Dahan. In that land, defend one per Dahan. Hmm. Um, I think I will just gather in there. Uh, there's no fear cards to resolve. We're ravaging in the jungles. We're defended there. The Dahan retaliate. We kill the explorer and the town, which generates a fear. Uh, this does nothing because we move the town. We're building in jungles. We're getting a city there. And a city here. Um, and we are exploring the first stage three card is sands and wetlands. So we go there. 
one there, one in wet bands, and one in not wet bands, and invader cards advance. And now we move on to the slow power phase. So we only have one slow power, it's plows shatter on rocky ground. Uh, we can do one damage to each town or city, a push up to one town, um, or destroy one town. And I think for this, I'm going to destroy this town, uh, which generates another fear. And that is the end of the slow power phase for this turn. And we move on. Time passes, nothing left to heal. We'll remove this defend. Uh, time passes, and we go on to the next turn. And for this turn, I think I'm going to choose growth option one and reclaim cards. I'm going to place a presence of the plays track and I'm going to place that there. Actually, no, I'll place it in there um, because it's to a mountain or land with my presence. I'll gain two earth elements, um, which I'll place there. And I'm going to play, there's the three energy from the energy track. I'm going to play Stubborn Solidity, which costs one. I'm going to play Rights of Land Rejection, which costs another one. Um, the Defend, one per Dahan, I will do in this land, target land here. Uh, so that will be a Defend 2. And then Invaders do not build in target land this turn. I'm going to choose this land. Um, and then one fear per town, city, or one fear per Dahan, whichever is less. So there's... Hmm, I guess I won't generate any fear with that. Um, yeah, I won't generate any fear with that. Um, move on to the events. Um, we are at stage two. Um, after the ravage step on each board, if no blight was added to this board, add one town to the highest numbered land with no invaders. Okay. Uh, be prey on the heedless in each land with beasts one damage per beast so we'll just do that take that explorer out and then on each board add one dahan to a land with two or more dahan hmm. so this would move it to three defend three um, that's going to clear out anyway I think I will add it to yeah I'll Add it to this land. Um, there's no fear cards. We're ravaging in mountains. Ravaging uh, in number seven adds a blight. I'm going to pay one energy because I have I have five earth elements, so I'll pay one energy to take it from the box instead of the blight card. Uh, because of my special rule, um, it doesn't outnumber my presence, so it doesn't cascade or destroy presence. Um, uh, we're ravaging here as well it's defended for 2 so they're doing 3 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 less 2 is 6 it, it adds a blight but I'm going to pay another energy to take it from the box um, stubborn solidity to Han and target land cannot be changed so they're going to retaliate for 4 uh, but I also have 5 earth so after, after invaders deal 1 or more damage to target land 2 damage so that'll be 2 damage uh, also deal half of the damage invaders did to the land rounding up so they did six because of the defend two uh, so we we do another three damage which takes out the town and the city which generates three fear and our first fear card so two and then three uh, the dahan also retaliate for four which clears that land out completely which generates another fear uh, that is the end of the ravage step. Um, we're building in sands and wetlands. So we, this gets a town, this gets a town, and this gets a town. Um, this, we have rights of land rejection, so they're not building in that this turn. Um, and then we're exploring into the mountains. So this gets one, and this also gets one. And we'll remove that. 
and the escalation effect is on each board with town cities add one town to a land without towns so I will put this here um, invader cards advance we have no slow powers so we move on to the next we lose these two elements nothing needs to heal and time passes um, And we move on to the next turn. So I think for this turn, I'm going to uh, choose growth option three. I'm going to gain a power card. And for this, I think I want to gain a major. So I think one, two, three, and four. Um, so we have flow like water, reach like air. Um, grant hatred, a ravenous form. Instruments of their own ruin. And walls of rock and thorn um, given the, the current situation of the board i think i'm tempted to take instruments of their own ruin um, it would be ideally um, walls of rock and thorn would probably be ideal because it's the only one with the earth element it also has a sun but for this turn i think i'm going to be able to use instruments of their own ruin quite well in this land um, so I think I'll take this uh, and for that I'm going to forget hmm. I will forget Scarred and Stony Land um, yeah I will gain three from the energy track and I can, pl well, I should place a presence first. Um, I'll place it there. It's in with, within range one. Um, so for this turn, I think I'm going to play, play uh, Instruments of Their Own Ruin and Plow Shatter on Rocky Ground. So one, two, three, four, one, two. Um, hmm. Let's do that. Um, so I will target instruments of their own ruin uh, within one of a sacred site. So I'll add a strife to the city. Um, each invader with strife deals damage to other invaders and target land. So this deals three damage, takes out the town and the explorer. We generate a fear. Um, we have three earth elements. Um, so whenever blight is added to one of our lands, we can pay two energy. I think I will use that in that land. Um, and we also need level one of this innate. So um, that's everything for uh, the fast power phase. Uh, we move on to the events. Promising farmland. We are still a healthy island. Uh, when exploring once per board, place one town instead of one explorer. A beast provoked on each board. Add one beast to a land without blight that has towns. Um, I will add that to there, uh, and then during ravage in every land with, uh, or in every land, defend one per dahan in that in the land, so that doesn't help us. Uh, we're still a terror level one, um, so each player removes one explorer town from a land with disease. There is no disease, so that does not help at all. We're ravaging in sands, nothing here. We remove the strife. Uh, this gets a blight. Uh, I'm going to pay two energy to remove uh, to take it from the box instead of the card. Um, and because we have the first level of uh, innate number two, after invaders deal one or more damage to target land, two damage. So we do two damage, uh, which generates another fear and another fear card. Um, and then this. Uh, only does one damage the Dahan retaliate it takes it out and then this gets a blight from the blight card and we are exploring into the coastal lands so this gets one this gets one and this gets one invader cards advance and we move on to the slow power phase um, so I only have one slow power and it's plow shatter on rocky ground and I think for this I will within range one I think I'm going to target uh, 
I will target this. So, hmm. yeah, uh, and generate one fear. And that is all for this round. Discard. Uh, there's nothing to heal. Time passes, and we move on to the next round. Oh, and one thing, I forgot the build step. So this gets a town, and this also gets a town. So next, I'm going to reclaim cards. Um, I will get two earth elements, and I will place a presence here. Uh, and I think for this turn, I'm going to play stubborn. Well, I'll get the four energy first. One, two, three, four. I'm going to play Stubborn Solidity and um, Coastal Lands, yeah, and Rights of Land Rejection. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six um, Earth Elements. So we will target this land for the Defend one per Dahan and do two. The Dahan cannot be changed in that land. Um, it will blight from the blight card, so we probably will go blighted island. But that's that's okay. And then for this card, I think I'm going to target um, target land number two. Um, yeah, I did that. Um, okay, so that's the end of the fast power phase. We do have the second level of this innate and we also have the second level of innate number two um, which i will use in, in this land here so we move on then to the events uh, and we have resourceful populace we still are at ter terror level one for the rest of this turn after an action destroys one or more towns or cities add one town to an adjacent land if there are no adjacent lands e.g due to isolate don't add anything Okay, on each board, add one disease to the inland land with the most towns or cities. Um, and that is number seven. Um, and then offerings of story and season. Each spirit with at least three Dahan amongst its lands. Among all its lands, gains one energy and may reclaim one card. Unfortunately, we have no cards to reclaim, but we do have three Dahan. So we benefit from that. Um, and then we move on to the fear cards. Terror level one, defend two in all lands with presence. That's very good. It's very good for us. It's going to prevent a blight cascade there. Um, that worked out well. So we're ravaging in mountains. So we're defended for four. It's attacking four. Dahan retaliate. Um, and this destroys a town, generates a fear. And because for the rest of this turn, after an action, destroys one or more towns, add one town to an adjacent land. So we will add this in there. Um, then we're also ravaging here. Um, we have the second level, so they're doing three, four, five, six, seven. Seven damage adds a blight. I'm going to pay one to take it from the box and not the card. It doesn't cascade because it doesn't outnumber our presence. And because they did uh, one or more damage, uh, we deal two back. So we will deal two to the city. We also have the second level and deal half the damage uh, invaders did to the land, rounding down. So they did seven, we we do three, so we'll take out the town and the city. So that's another three. So two, generous Saphir card, and the third. Um, and after, for the rest of the turn, after an action destroys one or more, add one town uh, to an adjacent land. So we will add this there and that is all for the ravage we're building in the coast so this gets a city um, this does not get anything um, sorry I should have also generated one fear per town city um, so that should be another fear um, so that doesn't get anything because of rights of land rejection and this has no nothing to build so that is the end of the build step and we are ex uh, exploring into the jungles. So this gets one, this gets one, um, and the escalation uh, uh, add one town to a land without towns. 
I think I will put this there. Uh, invader cards advance. So we're ravaging in coastal lands next. We have no slow powers, so we discard these. Um, and there is nothing to heal in time passes. And so we move on then to the next turn. For this turn, I think I'm going to choose growth option two. I'm tempted to go off the energy track to get a minor and plus one card play. But I think now I think I will take it from the plays track and I'll place it in this jungle here. I'll get the three energy from the growth option and another three from, or four, sorry, from my presence or energy track. Um, and the reason I took it off plays is to be able to reclaim Stubborn Solidity. So we're still at two card plays a turn. Um, and I think I'm going to play Instruments of Their Own Ruin and Stubborn Solidity. So we'll play four and one. We have one, two, three, four Earth Elements. Um, and that is, yep, that's right. So I'm going to target one away from a Sacred Site. I'll add one strife to this land. Um, each strife deals damage to other invaders in target land, so that will take that out. And then defend one per Dahan, so we have a defend of four here. Um, and that is all for the fast powers. We do have, like I said, four earth elements, so we have uh, level two of that, but we only have level one of this. Um, so that is the fast power phase over with the event then smaller ports spring up uh, we are at stage two on each board with exactly one coastal city add one time to a coastal land without cities so we have two coastal cities so that is good in lands with disease strife invaders skip ravage actions uh, okay um, and then on each board choose a land with towns and dahan uh, push one town per two to hand there. Uh, um, hmm. I think I will, I will choose, I will choose this land and because there's only one to hand, I can't push anything. Okay, so the fear card, we're at tear level two. Each player adds one strife in a land with dis uh, beast, disease, or dahan. For the rest of this turn, invaders have minus one health per strife to a minimum of one. So we can add one strife to a land with beast, disease, or dahan. I don't want to add it in there because I want the max damage. Um because the Dahan can't be harmed. So I think I will add it. Minus one health per strife. Okay. I'll add it there. Uh, because that has a beast. So that, okay, so we're ravaging in coastal lands. Um, because of the event card, uh, invaders uh, in lands with disease or strife skip ravage actions. So that's not ravaging. This is ravaging for three, four, five, six, seven. It's defended for four, uh, and the Dahan can't be harmed. So we will pay uh, one energy to take that from the box instead of the card. Um, and it doesn't destroy my presence. So they did m one or more damage, so we, get, uh, we deal two damage back. Um, so that's down to one health. And then the Dahan retaliate uh, for seven less. Uh, Dahan retaliate for eight. So that's one. Generates two. And a fear card. Two, three. Another fear. Four and five. And that is that for the Ravage. Uh, we'll remove that. They're building in jungles, so nothing to build. They're getting a city there. Um, and we're exploring into the wetlands. So this gets, there's no source for this wetlands. And this gets one. And the escalation is we need to add a town 
uh, to a land without towns. Um, and it's going to ravage in the jungle next. So I think I will add this. I'll add it in here. Um, yeah, I've allowed it in there. So, Invader Cards Advance. He has no slow powers. So, that is the end of that round. And time passes, there is nothing to heal. So, we move on to the next round. Okay, and for the next turn, I think I will play growth option number two again. Um, and I'll take it from the top track and I'll place it in my presence there. I'll gain the three energy plus the four. Uh, I also gain a minor, uh, minor power. So one, two, three, four. And for this, we have visions of fiery doom. Um, Haunted by primal memories, drought, and sear anger into the wild lands. Uh, I think it's probably going to be between haunted by primal memories and drought. Um, and I think I'm going to choose drought because it has the sun element as well. So that will get us our second sun element along with stubborn solidity. Although I also have instruments of their own ruin. Um... But I think, hmm, it's a tough choice. Uh, I think I will, yeah, I think I'll take Drought. Um, and so for this round, I, I have three card plays, so I'm going to play uh, play all, all three of my remaining cards, which are all slow powers. I do have one, two, three... <laughs> Three earth from cards plus three from there, so I have six earth in total, um, which meets, but no plants, so I only meet the second level of an eight one, and the second level of an eight two, um, which I will use in that land. So we move on then to the events. Um, uh, missionaries arrive. They teach us. They teach and spread lessons of a foreign god. You may. Ignore their contact with the Tahan for each board. Discard the top minor power. If it has sun, push one explorer from a land with Dahan. Otherwise, replace one Dahan with one town. After resolving this card, return it to the event deck under the top two cards. Or I can pay four energy per player aided by sun. Each spirit adds one disease to a land with cities. Two fear per player. During the next normal ravage, cities do plus three damage. I think I'm going to choose the second option and pay four. I have one sun in play, which counts for one. Uh, so I'll pay three uh, to make that up. Each spirit has one disease to a land with cities. So I think I will add that there. Uh, two fear per player. And during the next normal ravage, cities do plus three damage. Okay, so that's going to do um, six damage instead. Uh and then prey on the unwary. Each beast destroys one explorer. Add one beast to a board without one. So we will destroy that explorer and that explorer. That worked out well. We won't build in that land now. Um, and that is the end of that event. Um, I will leave that there to remind us of the Ravage modification. And then Terror Level 2. Each player chooses a, a different land with the hand. One damage per the hand there. So I will choose... Hmm. I think I will choose this land because it's the only one. Um, and that is that. So we're ravaging in jungle, nothing in land number two. This is doing three plus the three from the event. So six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, nothing for that uh, strife because it's strife. So we'll remove the strife. It's done ten damage. It gets a blight. I'm going to pay one um, to take it from the box and not the card. Then we also have the second level here, so we retaliate with two plus half the damage rounded down. So we, we do a total of seven damage, so that's three, four, five, six, seven. So that's two for the city, so one and two, uh, and one each for the town, so another two. So that's, that's the end of the ravage. Uh, we're building in wetlands, there's nothing to build there. This is getting a city. 
uh, and we're exploring into the mountain and wetlands. So this is no source, um, mountains, mountains, and this final wetlands. Invader cars advance and we move on to the slow power phase. Um, and for this, I'm going to, um, I will use Plow Shatter on Rocky Ground to um, hmm. I'm going to push this town in there um, so that is or one one damage to each town okay so that's um, push up to one town so that's that done um, I'm going to uh, I'm going to add a badlands in this using jagged shards uh, push from the earth and push to the hand in here and then for this I think I will do I want to um, I think I will destroy three times one damage to each I'm just gonna I'm not going to uh, do the effects of that card I played it for the elements because I don't want to add a blight. So that's the end of the slow power phase. Um, we discard there is this time heals in time passes and we move on to the next round. And so for this turn I'm just going to choose growth one, uh, reclaim cards, I get two earth elements uh, and I'm going to place a presence in this land here. Um, oh no, I can't, sorry. A mountain or a uh, land with my presence, so I think I'll place that here. Again, six energy, so three, four, five, six. Um, and I think I'm going to play, I have three card play, so I'm going to play these three cards. So instruments of their own ruin, stubborn solidity, and drought. Um, I will play four for instruments and then one each for stubborn solidity and drought. Um, I'm going to add strife, one strife within range one of his sacred site. I'll add it here. Each invader does one, each invader with strife does damage to other invaders, so that clears out that. Um, I don't have the threshold effect. Uh, defend one per Dahan in target land. Mm. Um, I won't uh, enact that card text. Um, actually, I will, sorry. So I'll defend three there. Um, and that is the end of that. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I meet the final threshold of innate two. Um, I still don't have a plant, so I only meet the, the threshold, uh, level two of innate number one. So that is the end of the fast power phase. We move on events. So tight knit communities, we are still healthy island. For the rest of this turn, towns, cities have plus one health. Ooh. Okay. Prey on the unwary, each beast destroys one uh, explorer, add one beast on a board without one. Um, so there, are, that's not possible. There are two lands with beasts are empty. On each board, add one to hand to a coastal land with the hand. So I will add that in there, and that's the end of that event. Uh, I will keep it there to remind us. Um, so we're at terror level two still. Each player adds one strife in a land with presence. Each spirit gains one energy per sacred site they have in lands with invaders. So we will add this strife. Um, ch -ch -ch. Hmm. I think we will add this. There. Um, then that uh, each spirit gains one energy per sacred site they have in lands with invaders. So one, two, three. So we get another three energy. That's the end of that. We're ravaging in wetlands. Nothing in eight. We're ravaging here for three, uh, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, and they have plus one health, towns and cities. 
So they do eight damage that adds a blight. I'll pay one energy to take it from the box and not the card. It doesn't cascade or destroy presence because there's now two and I have two presents there. Um, so it defends for three. So they did eight less three is five. So uh, I deal two damage back um, plus um, half of five rounded down. So it's four in total. Uh, so that takes out the city because it has plus one health. So that's another two fear, another fear card. Um, and then because I have two suns and seven earth, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, I can do that again. So um, it was four damage. So this has three health, so I'll take that out for one, uh, one fear. Uh, and I'll do one damage to there. The Dahan also retaliate, which takes out the remainder in there. And it gives another fear. That's the end of the ravage step. We're building in the mountains and wetlands. Nothing to build there. The disease prevents the build there. Nothing to build there. And this gets a town. Um, and then we are exploring into the jungle and wetlands. So no source for there. This gets one. This gets one. And this also gets one. And so the invader cards advance. We have one uh, slow power. It's uh, drought, so destroy three towns, one damage to each town uh, or city. Add one blight. Um, so I will add a blight. I will target this land uh, and place the blight. Um, and because we have three suns, we can destroy the city there, which gives another two fear. And that is terror level three, and there are no towns or cities left on the board. Uh, well, no cities predominantly because we're at terror level three. So that's uh, that's a win for Stones on Yielding Defiance. Um, I really like this spirit. He, uh, or it, it has very good energy income. Um, I I like the innates. I like the flexibility you have with uh, the special rules, being able to take the blight from the box and not the card. Um, so it, it's a lot of fun to play, uh, and yeah, that was that was a good uh, good test. The BP are obviously quite a quick um, adversary to to get going. Um, so I was this is the first time I've played Stone against BP, um, so I wasn't sure how it would how it would hold up against them. But um, yeah, it was a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, let me know in the comments below if you have any suggestions or questions or anything um, but other than that i think i'll leave it there for today um, thanks for joining and hopefully you can join again soon